Have you heard about the plan to inject carbon dioxide directly into the Great Artesian Basin? This is the Great Artesian Basin in Queensland. It's one of the largest underground freshwater resources in the world. This is Glencore's Milmerran coal-fired power station. Right now, most coal-fired power stations are closing or transitioning to renewables. But Glencore doesn't want to do that. Instead, they say they want to capture the CO2 at the power station, liquefy it, put it in a truck, and ship it over 100 kilometres to a small farming town in western Queensland. There, they say they will inject that liquid carbon dioxide about 2,300 metres underground into one of the key aquifers in the Great Artesian Basin. But here's the problem. This so-called carbon capture and storage, or CCS, doesn't work. It's essentially a PR exercise for massive corporations like Glencore to dodge their responsibility for causing climate change. Experts tell us that injecting CO2 underground can massively increase the acidity of the water. It can dissolve the rock that makes up the aquifer and lead to contamination with heavy metals like arsenic and lead. That's why local farmers and environmentalists are fiercely opposed to this. But right now, it's up to the Queensland Labor government to decide whether they will approve or reject this project. We need everyone to contact Premier Stephen Miles and Environment Minister Leanne Leonard to tell them to stop this insane project from going ahead.